Hello guys, welcome back to the channel and welcome back to more so other. We are here in Zerbai Quarries and the contract that I want to take is the Bloodhound Gang in the District Mayor's office and you can go here and it says uh, to go to the strip between Quarries Observation Tower in Southwest Slope uh, says Scout is recommended but you uh, you can use whatever you feel like so we're just going to start this and then I'm going to look for uh, International Road Star and then we're just going to uh, recover it yeah so uh, so that we are here and then we start from the garage so okay so uh, first is first we need to go uh, to this point which is I think reachable from here yeah so that would uh, be this and okay let's replot okay so i'm gonna go out this way this way this way that way that way that way and then from here you go this way and that way cool so that's one uh we will tackle these these one at a time so yeah and uh, you will say why I have the international load start because it is the best scout there is it's fast it is it is not small but it is capable and I've got an autom autonomous scout uh, winch on it so yeah you will see now in a while why I have gone for this one I have chain tires on this one, so you know, uh, instead of mud, mud tires, because I feel that on road we also need grip, duh, and yes, the load star delivers. The only issue is uh, the fuel consumption, but then again, if you're going close to somewhere close to the garage you can always recover from whenever wherever we are instead of traveling to the second point if it's closer to the garage we will just recover the truck and then drive to the second point instead of going from the first point to the, uh, the second which makes sense always Actually, there's no need to use a scout if you don't want to. But since the game says to, well, yeah, the game says the scout is recommended, and I have a scout newly discovered favorite, so I just thought I was going to use this. Also, show you guys how this uh, truck performs. As you can see, it's uh, it just performs like the Tega goes anywhere without hesitation speed is good uh, traction is all right does get stuck uh, in the super mud yes uh, apart from that no complaints whatsoever I actually find it better than the 750 in some places although the 750 is more capable because of the uh, because of the fuel, because of the repair points and all. But this one is also very good. I do think that we have repair points on it. Some repair points, but no fuel. So 130 liter is all I've got. Oops. You see how it tackles the mud? Doesn't even drop down from the fourth gear. Feels like I'm riding a wild bull. Okay. There it is. I do not think that this is doable, but I do think now that it is. Okay. So I turn here, I turn here, 
chain dye is going to help me get traction on these rocks. And there you go. See, so it's going to be where is the next one? So, go to the observation tower. Now, I have to go here to find the observation tower, which is there. Okay. Mm -hmm. So, I think I'm just going to recover it. Go this way. Then here, then here, and uh, this way, then here, this way, this way, this way, and then here. Actually, the task is already there. I came here for a watchtower, so. Uh, now you now that you have seen that the international load star is capable, I'm just gonna reverse this into that. There you go. That stage is also complete, and now for the final one, we have to go somewhere there. All right. So, okay. So to be honest, now. Now we're just going to go there to the International Load Star. I'm going to recover this because I'm going to need that fuel later. Recover. Uh, leave. And then I'm going to go here and get rid of all of that. So we want to go all the way here. I think I'm just going to go to the road. Road, road, road. And go this way, go this way. Now, there is this thing in the middle and you can't cross it, so uh, I think I'm just going to go uh, here, then this way, this way, this way, up back here, this way, and we want to follow this road, okay? And then to there, okay. Cool, 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 cool. I go to the, uh, on the outer road because I want to discover the map. But you can choose to go to the into the inner road. That's totally up to you. Thank God the puzzle was there. It saved me thirty percent of the drive. Time is now nice and bright, at least I can see. And, uh, and you guys can see how the International Load Star performs. It is... It is actually turning out to be the best scout in this map. The speed and the... Ah, sorry, I am sleepy. Uh, but the speed and uh, the traction. Oh la la, Snowrunner so hates me. This we have already taken, so yeah. I think we're just gonna go through the contracts first and then come to these tasks. Or if the task is needed for a contract, then we will probably come and do the task first and then continue on with the contracts. Once that is finished, then we will complete all the tasks. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And then once all of the tasks are finished, then we will do the cleanup bring all the trucks back, sell all the trailers, gather whatever is left on the map and sell that as well. I still have to do with Duncan Bay cleanup. Lots of trucks, a lot of trucks are there. I still have to bring them back.
Okay. So if I want to go there. I think I'll just have to destroy your temporary fences. There you go. Rail beam. It is what it is. I can't pass through uh, that thing. And so I have to go here. Why do I have uh, these missions? Why do they have these missions? I have it because I want to finish it. Why do they have these missions where you just want to go from point A to point B? Aren't they already doing this in expedition? Uh, I guess they did not begin to do whatever they want. Start in here. There's the task. There is no task. Okay. Finally, out on the road again. So now to the bit of the map that is unexplored. I think that's the hangar where, where we need to come for uh, I think the barrel delivery, the oil barrels and stuff. And then there's also a contract there. Wow. Unnecessary mud. I should have gone uh, through the little hill. It's okay. How I expect you to go through here? <laughs> oh, 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 oh. Okay, so I'm cutting through here then. The road is going somewhere else, so I'm going somewhere else. But I have to be just careful where I got it now. Because this is now off the little path. I do think that if I am going to abandon my marker and follow like this, I think that will be better for me. There it is. The, that was a tremendous scouting operation. This is the perfect spot for the radar. We just need to get in there and then we will be golden. Oh, here's a reward for the valuable data. 310 for the experience and 5,400 5, for the compensation. So that was cool. The Blahound Gang is complete. 
Thank you guys for watching. I hope you like the content and please really like, share, comment, subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. I'm posting videos every day. If you made it this far, thank you so much. I will see you in the next one.